Good morning everyone. Today's video is all about shopping and today I am shopping at the inexpensive retailers to show everyone how you can put outfits together at a fraction of the cost and still look stylish. So style for me is not about how much money you spend, it's how you put outfits together. Now recently I've had a couple of um, dresses on, very lightweight flowy dresses because we're in summer here and it's extremely hot so if I look like I'm sweating I am and people have said where did you get those now they were $35 each and people are amazed and I know there's a lot of people that have said to me they can't afford to spend a lot of money so today I'm going to uh, go and show you how to put a couple of outfits together so I'm going to Target, um, I've already done best and less I've done uh, Target with my two floral dresses, which I'll show you later in the video. And today I'm going, so they're casual outfits. Today I'm going to Target Kmart and Big W, and I'm going to get some more dressy outfits. Keep in mind, I live in a subtropical climate, so I probably dress down a lot more than, say, Sydney, Brisbane, or, you know, LA, or wherever you come from. So I'm going to take you along. I'll show you my outfit later on because my outfit is has all been on the sale rack or inexpensive items this dress which i'll show you later is like a slip dress which is not everyone's cup of tea but i love it i can't remember how much i paid for it i think it was about 40 50 dollars on the sales rack um, i have some uh dupes for valentino shoes which i got last week for 90 dollars and my jewelry too has also um is also from um inexpensive places um boj earrings and I do have a ring on from Kate Spade which I got overseas in the consignment or what do you call it the um, DFO stores the yeah the cheap shopping stores um, I do have my Louis Vuitton uh, with me today so that is an expensive bag but I'm going to have a look at what you could use instead of that bag so come with me let's go shopping okay so I've arrived at the shop so I forgot to say I put this in the car just to show you so what I do uh, is I get these magazines regularly. So this is December 2017's Harper's Bazaar. And what you can do is look through it and look at all the fashions. So we'll just get to something that's Dior. You can look at the shape of the glasses, for example. You can go and then and get an alternative or a dupe that looks exactly the same as that, but you don't have to pay the price. Maybe from Kmart, Colette Heyman, um, yeah even best and less i live in australia so i'm using my cheaper shops um overseas i'm sure you have the same so look here for example on this page we have some green we have some uh yellow and some mustard so what you do is you look at the fashion and then go and see what you have in the shops for a fraction of the cost so style to me is being able to put, if you can afford expensive pieces, fair enough, but not everyone can. But even if you could afford everything expensive, I don't like the look of it. I think it's more creative and you have your own style when you put your inexpensive and your expensive pieces together, or you're able to wear all inexpensive pieces and make it look very stylish. So that's what I do. So that's just a little tip. Like, look at this black dress. I mean, this black dress, where's it from? It's Samantha Armitage. Uh, so that's a Victorian Beckman dress. Um, so that would be quite expensive, does it say? Yes, 3263 Now you could get um, a dress very similar to that. And look for all the bargains at this time of year. We're in January here, very hot. But you could um, get something like that on the um, bargain rack um, and then put it aside even if you didn't want to wear it this season because this dress won't really date. So off to the shops I go. So here is Big W, so I'm going to go in just to see what they have. As you can see, lots of bargains on it this time of year, so $20. The off the shoulder really um, on trend at the moment, so let's just see what they have in the more dressier section. Like I said, Big W, I'm looking for something a bit more dressy, not over dressy, but maybe a nighttime outfit or something I can wear to work these people think I'm strange talking to a camera but that's all right just got to find the right section right, I found something already I do love these so they're like the three-quarter pants and they're only $15 I think that would look fab with a nice shirt and maybe 
uh, white top or yeah white top and you could put some other accessories with it but let me see what else we can find so $15 not bad. so I have quite a few things here I'm going to try on oh, oh wasn't too sure of the sizes so I've had to double up on a couple of items so I will try them on see how I go cheap prices great fashion okay I have been successful as you saw it cost me $25 uh, whole outfit for $25 that I can wear to work and I'll have lots of things at home that can go with it and also what I'm pleased about is I can wear this in winter as well with the jacket over it so success see you can shop very um, inexpensively and still look good so I'm gonna go now to Colette Heyman and look for a dupe for handbags um, I've got my red handbag with me now but I want to show you what you can get from Colette Heyman maybe that would go with this outfit or any other other outfit Novo also has some good dupes in handbags and shoes. I'll show you the ones that I'm wearing now. These are them over here. And I love them and they're very comfortable. So the dupe of Valentino. Of course a red handbag behind it. So these shoes I think were about $90 and I got another pair for $20. So second pair $20 that I can wear with my other casual maxi dresses. So handbags as well. So that's me with my shoes on. Okay, that has been successful. So I'm off to Kmart now. I have to drive to another shopping center. It is so hot, so I'm just getting my air conditioning going in the car. But $25 for one outfit is really good. And I'll have other things at home I can wear with it. So off we go to Kmart now, see what we can find. Okay, I've just arrived at the other shopping center, so now I just have to find Kmart. Um, but before I go in, I always set myself a plan. So I had said something to go to work or go out with. So I got my work outfit and big W. So now I'm going to look for something that's um, casual, but a bit dressy that I can dress up and down. So maybe something I can wear out to have uh, to a barbecue, to have drinks with a girlfriend, maybe to have lunch, something like that, just to make my wardrobe a bit more balanced. Once again, I'm looking at, um, a, you know, not a lot of money, so I'll see what I can get. Um, it actually quite excites me to go in. I love shopping and I love to go in and see what bargain I can find and when you hear a lot of people um, there's videos on YouTube how I save for designer stuff this is how people do it they can't unless you're really wealthy they just buy cheaper things um, fashion things or you know don't eat out and things like that so this is what I do and I love the creativity of it so I'm gonna go in and see what I can find so come with me successful in there the dress cost me $20 and a pair of earrings $4 so $24 and I have an outfit Yay! it was um, a bit harder and there was a lot of children going back to school so and I'm very happy with what I've got so more casual but I can wear it and have wine with my friends so I'll just show you when I get back home so that was a very successful shopping trip um, I don't think the only thing that um, I don't like about um, discount shopping or bargain shopping is that there's no pretties involved but if you don't mind that that's fine so when you go to witchery or forever new a number of others um, you get them wrapped in tissue paper or in a nice bag but that's what you get for um, that's why prices are low so two outfits first one cost 25 and the second one cost 24 
like this video, please subscribe, push like, and follow me on Instagram. And don't forget, everyone, Ada Love Style. See you again next time. Bye.